what it do, what it don't, what it is, what it isn't. You already know what this is. This is Once We're Not Saying, magazine dedicated to shit that I'm into, ZN. I'm your host, P5, aka P equals MC squared. And this is another episode of Two Feet Bear Crepes. Let's get into it. And drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. Can you tell what it is yet? Can you tell what it is yet? Hmm, can you tell what it is yet? Maybe not, maybe not, maybe. Alright, let's stop playing around. You see what that says. Weaver, Jason Weaver. Ha ha ha. Okay, guys, this is a Clark's Originals Weaver in a size UK9. Funny enough, a UK9 is actually too big for me. Let's do it like this. Um, nothing in the box really. Let's put that down. Let's put this up here. Give you the twirl to the RJ. You see the colour. Mm. Mint green. So sexy. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. Mm, look at it. Alright guys, let's not spend all day looking at that and let's get into the shoe. Mm. So this is a Clark's Weaver. Feast your eyes on that. It's definitely my favourite. I mean, I was a Wallabies man, but you know, I think the Weaver is... Mm. I mean, bank robbers are beautiful as well, but I think the Weaver is the is the is the go-to. I mean, mm, yeah, I'm, I need to get some more of these. Um, all right, cool. I've copped these maybe about four years ago. I'm not sure. I can't remember. But um, as you can see, the crop circle, that beautiful gum sole or crepe sole, as you can see. Um, you know, that's where the word crepes come from. But um, that's another story. Ugh, look at it. I've been in their field and I've I've picked up some of their bloody feathers I don't know but yeah look at that crepe sole beautiful lovely that's the colour it used to be beautiful give you the all the way round mm, look at the shape on that of course you know the shape you see that that stitching let me just give you a close up of the stitching you see the craftsmanship that's gone into that mm, yum what are you gonna say you're gonna say, ooh, hey, look at that. So you've got that nice stitching on the upper right there, giving you a sort of different style. Of course, look at when you look at it from that way, look at that, you see it sort of curves up. So it's not like a, a standard shape, it gives a little curvage right there. Of course, you've got that nice little, um, like a suit and tie, bow tie kind of thing. You've got your, your um, classic Clark's hang tag right there you know we leave these on I don't know about other people but you know we always leave these on beautiful um, this is the finest maybe not the finest but the suede is mm, it's, it's beautiful it's beautiful it feels soft it just feels like mm, as you notice since I picked it up I haven't stopped touching it beautiful suede of course you've got matching laces um, in that fetching green you've got undo on each side that's two um, two lace holes boom of course inside you've got that leather insole you see why it says Clark's original beautiful um, let me see if I can find out where this one was made because ideally you want them made in England this was made in Vietnam you know I can live with that but you know you want them made in England really but it's rare that you get those anymore you know it's a special if it's made in England now I got these in a size 9 and they're still a bit big I would say an eight and a half would have been perfect but they didn't have um, half sizes um, Clark's I'm never really sure that's why to be honest buying them online I bought these in store no I bought these online but buying them online sometimes is tricky um, but yeah um, be wary of that if you're looking for your first pair of Clarks maybe go try them on first each style and then you can see what you are in a, a weaver a wally um, a bank robber aka the um, desert trek um, also a desert boot you know those are the four main ones that you want to try on but yeah um, guys this has been another episode of two feet bear crepes um i love the color on these you see my stony jumper um hoodie the vintage one from eight from the 80s perfect color for this um definitely gonna have to um, pair those two at some point but yeah um guys um as always stay dope stay fly um and yeah um just continue to chase whatever it is that you want and yeah just believe that you are enough and um, also remember, all of that, oh, I am enough and stuff, it, it's all well and good. But just remember, you've got to be a good person as well. You know, make sure you're a good person and then you'll attract the good. Even if it seems like you have been a good person and, you know, shit's just fucked up all the time. You know, little little incremental changes. But anyway, um, let me not preach. That's for a different segment. You know what it is, gang. Stay dope, stay fly. I'm going to catch you on the flip side. Yo, hello, hello. Yeah, P Green, huh?
dope. <laughs> Peace.